Oh, my shield is has a plus one to saving throw. Well, you say detour. Oh, I should go maybe see if that guy needs to finish being rescued. I couldn't really do anything with this guy in here last time. Man, I feel like I should be able to bring health in. I'm upset. Maybe I'll text my friends. Mm, I want to have a word. <laughs> oh my gosh, did I? Okay, fine. It's for a sister's wedding. I made a stupid joke about keeping it. We argued about it for hours. Then she took the dowry and left. Okay, okay. I don't care. I don't want to steal your dowry money. We learned where the crash is located, but we can't go there. Right? Like, yeah. We can't- it's like, you can go. I'm like, no, I can't. Unless the mountain pass is kind of where the shadow stuff's at. Where's the moonrise towers? Smell that. Fresh forest air. I smell only fear. The fear of cowards lying in wait for an ambush. Huh? You can take a day off once in a while, Lazer. Yeah. I do not take days off. I'd even forego sleep if such a thing were feasible. The one advantage an elf holds over a Githyanki. We'll bring Lizelle out for a while because I need to... I feel like I need to give her some screen time. Hang on. Hey, you. I need to t apparently need to talk to her about in soul coins. It's not that I want to collect them per se. It's just that if we should happen upon them, I can use them in battle to fire up my engine. Evil's evil, but it can be put to good use. Sometimes. Maybe. Right? I mean, I figured the soul coins would be useful for you. But, uh... What are you thinking about? We've done all these. We've done these two, and we've done that. And so... I do... I'm gonna switch what's-her-name out for Gale, because I feel like Gale has a higher perception, he has a higher intelligence. And I believe those... Oh, but I could summon... I could summon Scratch if Scratch isn't too busy having a seizure. Yeah. Apparently I can't do anything. Speak. Quickly. So you stay here. Chuck. You believe you can survive without I'm me? I'm doing my pretty well my whole life. As you say, do not keep me waiting. You wish to speak? Still very well at camp? With such stimulating company? Oh my. <laughs> Never better. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm gonna text my friends and be like, I've got a house in here at my camp and I can't get him out. <laughs> He's like, I'm at one with nature here. I'm like, please come out with me. <laughs> please go outside with me. Okay, let's bring Gale for now. If Yankee patrolling oh. these wilds is an unexpected surprise. Whatever they seek, they'll not hesitate to kill us if we stand in their way. Join me. With pleasure. Lead on. Thank you. Um, let's leave. Did you succeed? I 
can't tell if he succeeded. Which way to the nearest library? Oh, let's see, actually. Um, he failed a perception check. Difficulty class 20. Oh, jeez. I guess I didn't I didn't realize you could do that. You could check you could, I was like hovering over it. I was like, what what's the roll, you know? He got a three? Really? It's almost a critical failure. Um In perception? Oh, it's a wisdom. Halston would be able to see it. I don't have anybody who's wise. <laughs> Uh, just me, me and Carlac are our wisest. <laughs> that bodes ill. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's funny. Um, well, I guess I can always come back to it. Um, are you guys coming? Where? Is Oh. Well, now I'm curious. How are they gonna get there? Oh, okay, okay, okay. <gasps> is this... <gasps> this is the owlbear! I need to bring Halston out with me! This is the owlbear cave! Can't slow down. Okay, I need to figure out how to get Halston out with me, because he's gonna be the one to help me here. Apparently, you know, you don't get to bring Halston out. Uh... And until it happens by itself. Okay, well, I mean, I, I guess I'll... The problem is, is, I think in this save, we've already talked to the owlbear, and she wanted us to leave. But maybe we can... sneak over to that statue? Maybe. Who do we have? We don't really have anybody who's stealthy. We don't really have anybody who's stealthy. Oh, it's glowing. Is this a saloon thing with the moon? Man, I keep feeling like for some of this stuff I should have Shadowheart out here. Because she's, uh... Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. What are you thinking about? Oh, you. I love you. Love you. Uh, no, what I wanted to do was pause everyone so we could... wonder if the gods are watching me. I wonder if the gods are watching me. I'll be down. A shrine to Saluna. Oh, who figured it out? Will succeeded on... I'm a paladin and Will succeeded? It is a shrine to Saluna. The glowing chest in the moon. Oh. This thing might Feel that? Its contents Magic. Oh, God. A spell sealed that chest Thank you. Tight. Thank you. Thank you, Will. So glad that you told me that before it exploded on me. Um, it won't... Give... It's easily... Why? Scroll of detect thoughts. Sure, I'll take that. The war between Saloon and Shar. An ancient tome detailing how Saloon came into being along with her sister Shard. The silver radiant Saloon and the dark alluring Shard complemented each other and brought an orderly distinction between light and dark in the universe. This was before they got angry at each other, I guess. Potion of animal speaking. What's gonna do? Well, what am I supposed to do? It's weak to being hit. <laughs> Interesting. Well. Time to hit it. <laughs> I do worry that it'll make, um... I worry 
that... What was I going to say? Um, I'll, I'll lose something. <laughs> Yikes! It said it was... It was good money. <laughs> oh, dang it. Well, I guess I will hop over here. You guys just... Okay, you can come with me. At the ready. Oh? That's curious. What? Oh. A Selunite prayer sheet. A prayer dedicated to Saloon, imploring all to accept the mood maiden's blessing and share in her... A prayer sheet? Oh. With the same symbol as the one on the chest. Oh, what is it? Uh, examine. Why would you tell me that, but I can't see it? Um, okay, what do you, what do you want me to do with this information? Wait a sec- why is the owlbear dead? Cut down by goblins. How cruel. What? Well, there's still an owlbear egg. Oh. Oh, dang. I don't know if there was anything I could have done. And it had a baby. Anything Where's the abuse? Where's the baby? <gasps> Can I talk? <gasps> the Oak Father's Embrace. Cool. Undead creatures that hit the wearer receive one to six radiant damage. This is a medium armor. I will send it to Will. Will gets all the good armor. Eyes open, mouth shut. Eyes open, mouth shut. Oh. Oh, never mind. Will doesn't get... I'm sorry, Will. You're naked. He only gets light armor. I keep forgetting that he's not a marshal, really. Like, I mean, he does have a blade, but... Well, dang. What What's about... Story? What about Carlac? I think she's not supposed to... Ahead. Wearing heavy armor impedes all positive effects of rage. Okay. So her constitution... Oh, her constitution's very high. Never mind. She'd have to wear something... Quite high. So right now she has, she has 13. No, 14. Because of the... I don't know. Oh, boy. Um, Let me see. Where's my... Oh, I'm on the wrong person. No one stopped me yet. <sighs> Oh, can't talk to beasts, but... Oh. Alright, well... <laughs> Owlbear hatchlings are tiny and adorable for the first few ten days of their life. Then they eat you out of house and home. Then they simply eat you. I'm taking it with us. More for me? An owlbear egg. These are supposed to be worth a fortune. No. No, we raise it. With haste. And we love it and take care of it, you monster. Here we can. Where's the baby? I didn't see a baby. Well, dang, I thought there'd be a clue over there with the owl bear. Apparently not. I don't know. I cannot see anything. I need to be wearing like an amulet or something. <clears throat> Do I need to wait until... No, never mind. There's no day-night cycles. I was like, I'll wait until it's dark. But that's... Like for the half moon, you know? Uh huh. There we go. My prayers are answered. My prayers are answered. 
Ooh. <laughs> She's just dancing. They don't provoke opportunity attacks. That's so good. I'm gonna give that to Carlac. An idol of saloon. Let's see, let's read this. This tome describes an ancient initiation rite observed by some who worship the moon goddess Saloon. When a youngster came of age, they would be left to, to fend for themselves deep in the wilds. There they would show their skills of navigation and self-reliance, as well as their determination to return to the moon maiden's silvery glow. Once they found their way back to their people, their faith and standing as a follower of Saloon would be beyond any doubt. So I, I have been kind of wondering this the whole time. We're like, Shar is supposed to be mean, and so therefore Saloon is supposed to be very kind. But I do wonder, because sometimes even goddesses that are supposed to be kind and wise do exceptionally cruel and petty things in the name of power. Um, so mm. I'm curious. Saloon like coming of age rituals. Yeah. Seems like a serious undertaking. Dangerous, even. I wonder if Shadowheart was here, if she'd be like, yeah, that's why Char is better. And I'm like, no, literally Char is like the incarnation of pain. Jeez, uh, maybe, and I think maybe they're actually more similar than they like to think. You know, Char and Saloon. Well, we got that. I will pick up this book. And we will go. <coughs> Well, that was a lot easier because apparently, I don't know how I let the owl bear die, but I'm sad. I didn't mean to. But sometimes inaction creates ripples, you know? Creates a ripple effect where other things happen that are outside your control. Um, but mostly I was just kind of hoping to use... I was hoping... To be able to walk along the river. Cannot do that. I can, but I can, I can walk here. Are you guys okay? What are you doing back there? It's not that hard to walk. And it's that is shallow water. That is some shallow water you guys were having a hard time with. Oh. Let's see what this does. An empty mind flare vessel. If its occupant survived, then nowhere to be seen. Eaten by the Albert. Oh, they've got a secret entrance to the Underdark way over here. But the secret entrance I know of is in the Goblin Camp. We have a hidden goblin stash. We know it's there, but we apparently can't find it because we're too stupid. <laughs> I don't know. Like, we kind of know where it is. It is a little silly. Um, that we know that, but we can't really do anything about it. Well, I'm going to assume, honestly, at this point, like, as far as I know, the Moonrise Towers is endgame. Again, I, I'm recording these fairly far in advance. I think I just uploaded episode 11 today. <laughs> so that gives you a bit of um, perspective. I did also just find out recently that not everybody was aware that Asterion's a vampire. And so when I just like dropped that he's a vampire, <laughs> it's like, what? So my bad. I just... I, I I don't even watch most of the promotional material. I didn't want to get too hyped. I didn't even watch the romance. There's like the romance of Asterion where they show you like a little bit in the early access. But I saw like a clip where he like bites somebody and that's like, woo, everyone's like, whoa, sexy, you know? And so I was like, he's a vamp. And he's got two bite marks on his neck. <laughs> like, and he's got, I didn't notice this part to be fair, but my friend pointed out that he has, and I checked it later, he's got blood bottles everywhere. Like, every, all over his camp, there's blood bottles everywhere. So, I just was like, oops, my bad, I, I am sorry. Because <laughs> uh, then, cause then, yeah, I was confused why he's like, just so you know, I'm a vampire. I was like, yeah, I know. 
I, I know. And he's like, oh. And I was like, not just trying to be like the, oh, playing it cool in the video game. I was like, no, I really did know. Yeah. And we have this, uh, oh no, not this. this. I don't really know. I don't know. Maybe at some point I'll look up what I'm supposed to do with it because I'm a cheater. But, um, we can't do this till we go to the Underdark. Can't do that till we go to the Underdark. Can't do that till we go to Moonrise. Can't do that till we go to the Mountain Pass slash Moonrise. Uh, Moonrise. Moonrise. Um, nothing here we can do except for Will. Um, you know, help him get, get his dad. The only thing I can see that we really can do right now is this, like, southwest corner where we, find, we figure out the hag situation. So that's where we're gonna go. Because I don't freaking know what else to do. I and mean, I'd like to be level 5 before I go underground. Oh my. Oh my gosh, they scared me. And I... I do have speak with animals on. I guess I'll just... Quick save and go harass Ethel. Light on my feet. Maybe kill her? I don't know. I actually do kind of want to explore around a little if I can. Kind of where that guy was, maybe? Yeah, let's go look around a bit. Never mind. There's a river. I can't. I can't go. Oh. Oh. Loot. Oh. What? What? A survival check. Oh dang. Seems simple enough. Um oh. Thank you, darling, Carlac. Ooh. For a potion of healing. Okay, good. My friend pointed out that she has stopped doing auto select for camp food ever since she got the owlbear egg. And apparently it does, it is in camp food. And I was terrified because I had to sneeze. <laughs> and I was terrified because I was like, no, what if I can hatch it on the off chance? I'm going to keep this egg forever. Although I do kind of wonder if maybe it goes bad, if the food goes bad after a while. Um, but yeah. Game immunity during falling damage. Woo! Alright. Well, I'm I'm curious. Let's, this is definitely giving me Witcher vibes. Whoa. Nasty surprise. Caution is warranted here. What do you mean? A spike trap. Okay, okay. Um You wanna you're charmed, I'm sure. Charmed, I'm sure. Let's, uh... I am a little worried about, um... What's the word? Going into the water, because in the Fallow Mire and Dragon Age Inquisition, you, if you walk into the water, you activate the corpses. And, uh... I keep... This reminds me of that, too, and I'm like... <gasps> oh, no! Oh, sure, he doesn't. Okay. I'm, I would maybe not normally do it, but he has four, and that's the max, so. Okay, okay, okay. Also, I have to turn the AC off when I record, generally. And it's a heat wave right now, and it is, I am already boiling. Is there, is there anything, just that's it? We don't get anything from it? Okay. Still breathing. And why am I so unhealthy? Like, what happened to me? I'd take a nap, but I feel like that would be wasteful. Cut, cut to me dying a horrible death. Chasm, uh, calm down. Calm. It's, a, it's like, what? Four or five feet of water? Okay, maybe. My, it's probably deeper. <laughs> maybe like ten feet of water. Ooh. Something good here, I hope. Whoa. I succeeded on a sleight of hand because it's a barbed bulrush. Because it's barbed. That's actually a really good idea. Is this... I think this is where I came in. 
Oh, also, I get distracted, but I could have swore. Could have swore. I do have a potion of flying. But I don't really think I want to waste it on that. Maybe I can jump from like here to here. We'll see. We'll see. I'm not too fussed. There's. Hmm. Let's see if we can't go on an adventure. Adventure! <gasps> Decrepit sanctuary worth. Okay, hang on. Hang on, I gotta jump back. And I gotta pick this up. I don't know why everybody has to make such loud jumping noises. They all sound like giants, like they're much denser than they are. Yes. Oh, hello, are you, you are hot, you are indeed hostile, awesome. Uh, let's actually get him over here. Ancient mud method. Salmon. Oh, it explodes. Okay. He's resistant to poison, but that's it. Alright. I don't think we can do much, but I guess I'll cast Octave Armor? We'll see. I don't think he really needs it, but it's hot in here. Dude, I, you ha, yes, it really freaking is. Ooh. Whoa. A surge of divine energy accompanies your swing and possibly pushes the target back. Oh no, there's a bunch. I should probably dash. Well, no, Will. Will can reach this one. Oh, she was oh, she was close enough for that. Dang it. Holy. A woodwood. I have heard of those. I need you to I need you to stop doing that. Oh, this is not good. Are we just gonna all summon? <gasps> oh, affected entity is covered in hardened mud and cannot move. Attack rolls against it have advantage, while the entity attack rolls and dexterity saving throws have disadvantage. Does remove burning and become resistant to fire damage. Well, that's something. I did, uh, I was like, well, if it explodes and does a little damage, that's not bad, but uh, apparently also if we get hit enough times or we roll poorly, you get muddy. Ow. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. Oh wow. I don't know what I did. Ah, I think I got all of them? I don't know what I did, but it was, uh, it was bad. I just killed everybody, essentially. I think I basically just killed everyone. I know I need to focus on these guys, because it's gonna be bad. I need to have my long-range guys focus on these ones, and the rank melee focus on these ones. Oh, boy. Protection's been coming in handy. I keep kind of messing things up, though. 
I keep missing. I don't know how. It has it's had one health for like ages. And and I keep missing. Oh my gosh. I thought I was not hitting them with <laughs> with that, but it looked good. I think I think the where the bodies exploded and hit them. So Well, that was a very effective attack, honestly. Uh, yeah, listen, I don't really- I- I know that I'm freaking, like, brute forcing this, but I'm re I really don't know what else to do. Come here. Come here. in my heart. Yeah, uh, yeah, we're coming, bud. I don't know why he doesn't seem to have. He doesn't seem to have any potions. 